you guys. Welcome back to the New Sport Universe Reacts. I know, I'm wearing glasses. I took out my contacts. Um, so basically what I want to talk about is the proposed baseball plan to start playing baseball in May and June. It's like a proposal, so it's not official at all. But basically, this has become the likeliest of plans, and let me explain what it is. So um, they would... It's like very confusing and it's pretty technical, so I guess I kind of really have to go into it. Basically what the plan is to, is to have a baseball for like two months in Arizona. Have all the teams there, all the players there, and hotels and everything. I think the reason they pick Arizona is for a couple reasons. First off, it's hot and um, the coronavirus, what I've learned is that when it's hot, it's not as spreadable and stuff like that. I'm not very sure about that, but that's what I think is one of the reasons. The second reason, which I think is even more important, is that um, Arizona offers Chase Field, which has a retractable roof, roof so they can play game, lots of games. It also has um, not grass. It has, what's that? Turf. So something like turf. So it's durable. Um, there's many spring training facilities. I think it was like 10 and other, uh, other um, park, not parks, other um baseball fields that might be able to be used i think so basically what i'm saying is the coronavirus might not be as spreadable there and also um because it's hot and also there's a lot of facilities for teams to be able to use that's what the idea is um there's a lot of things that go into it It sounds simple like okay just bring everyone into one area there's a lot that goes into it first off these players um would have to be fine with not seeing their family for two months um, just playing baseball, they would have to be tested s like so many times to check for the coronavirus because if one person gets it in there, like, I don't even know what the idea would be, but like, you'd have to, I don't know. It would be an isolated area. Um, there's a lot of things they're talking about. First off, putting an electronic strike zone, um, Basically, they want to reduce, they want to social distance while playing baseball, which is really confusing, or try and social distance as best as possible. So these are what they're saying. Electronic strike zone. Um, players wouldn't be sitting in dugouts, but we be sitting in the stadium seats that are empty, obviously, because there wouldn't be fans, which is another thing. Um, they'd be sitting in the stadium seats as far away from each other as possible, I guess. Um, there'd be no mound visits. There's just so many things involved. Um, secondly, so the spring training facilities aren't equipped with like replay things and replay uh, technology that's basically been in the game for a, a good amount of time at this point. And what they're saying is, will they make it replay eligible and put all that money into it? Is it worth it? Um, or are they just going to go back to when there wasn't replay? Uh going to be very interesting um if i had to it's a good thing i'm not in this position that i have to make this decision because it's really hard because there's there's positives and negatives positives it brings back a familiarity of the world being back to normal somewhat um money influx into these companies like fox and all baseball and getting money back into the pockets of jobs and employers and things like that which is important obviously but it's not going to be baseball um it is going to be baseball obviously but like it's not if that makes any sense you're like you're going to be watching a game no fans they did it in camden yards in 2015 that was one game and it was very weird um you're going to see players sitting in um sitting in not sitting next to each other like it's, it would be so weird if they did it. I mean, at this point, it might be something that they will do because they need the money. Um, it'll just help in a lot of ways. And, like, if I'm thinking about it now, I know I just said I don't think I'm a fan of it. I'm pretty sure I said that. But maybe it makes sense. I mean, no, I'm taking that back. I, I think it... There's too much technical stuff that goes into it. Um... And I don't even like I don't even know if it's worth it really. Um it could increase the likelihood of coronavirus, another like big spread of it, which you don't want. Um players not being able to see their families, baseball just being strange at that point. Um 
baseball just not being baseball. And I don't know if that's what people, if that's like the familiarity that they're trying to get across. Um, that's really it. Um, I'm going to do a point of view on this. It should be a uh, much better quality. I'm going to do it tomorrow morning, but I need to get out reacts. Um, got kind of late, so happy I could make this. But other than that, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.